You had a wonderful time on the olive grove. Thank you, Aspasia. Look at how beautiful the olives are. The one that use the stick and go down, and the other that have uh, it's responsible for the net. Mm. This one. So they try to clean it to get out the, the leaves. Mm -hmm. The most of them. I had a chance to try the olive pickers and it was showering, it was all over the place. I'm wearing sunglasses because I kept getting nailed and also Masako was getting nailed by the olives I picked too. I tried but it was heavy so I gave up in one minute. Each basket is 15 kilos. Look how heavy it is. Now they are going to the olive oil mill to be ready to be an olive oil. Meanwhile, we'll walk around, see how beautiful it is, and of course we need to eat. One thing we tried on Crete was tacos, which is a dried twice baked bread, and you put olive oil and tomatoes and cheese on it. It's very unique and crunchy and lots of olive oil. After we finished lunch, we got to watch them actually press the olives in their facility. Many, many farmers, everybody has sacks and boxes of olives all waiting at the olive press. And the gentleman we were working with picked olives all day long until sunset and then pressed all night. Notice all the men are doing the work, no, not women. They put it into the sack and then it goes down the hole and it will come up and they will separate the leaves with the olives. The olives go up the ladder, all the leaves are separated out through this big machine. And then you have it coming out having a bath. And it's still in the conveyor belt, spraying it into the bath and then the water flowing over it, washing it a little. Then it gets scooped up out of the water and get lots of spray to keep it clean. And Masako is colored as an olive. Now, after this moon, they are going to go through the crushing. So there will be no more mm, olive solid. It will be crushed and it will be made like a paste. And then the olive pressed juice stuff paste goes into this big machine. Uh, they add a little bit of water, it's a centrifugal compressor, and it squeezes out all the juice. And after that, ta-da! Olive oil. Hmm, I want to taste. Let's see. It looks beautiful. It is green, and I was surprised with that.